Today is a day you will always remember, the greatest in anyone's life. We'll start off the day just two people in love and end it as husband and wife. It's a brand new beginning and start of a journey with moments to cherish and treasure. And although there'll be times when you both disagree, these will surely be outweighed by pleasure. Naomi, where do I begin to say how much I love you and how happy I am I can call you my wife? Writing this part was truly easy because I didn't have to think and I let my heart do the talking. Words can't describe how beautiful you look today and just knowing that I'm sharing the rest of my life with you really does make me feel that I've succeeded in life. I know I'm a very lucky man. You understand all of my complications and accommodate as best as you can, even if it puts you out. And for that, I'm truly grateful. With you in my life, I know that happiness will always be there. I love you because you're my future, my present and part of my past. My world has been turning so quickly and time just keeps moving so fast. I love you because you have something no ordinary person could give. Warmth that I'll cling to forever, hold on to as long as I live. I love you because of your devotion. It is tender and wonderfully rare. And no one could ever imagine the magical moments we share. I love you because you are truthful. Your eyes hold a key to my heart. I know that you share my commitment and we know that we never shall part. I love you because you're wonderful and give me all that I need. A hug when I seek reassurance and a smile when we've disagreed. <laughs> I love you because I just love you for too many reasons to say and I'll always be right here beside you, breath and a heartbeat away. I first met Jack about 10 years ago. Well, I didn't actually meet you. I dropped Naomi off at their designated meeting spot, which was the SO garage in Rush Green Roundabouts. <laughs> Classy. And as I watched her walk towards this tall, handsome, curly-haired young man, I knew then that he was going to be someone special in her life. Little did I know I was witnessing her first love and the future Mr. and Mrs. Brazier. Jack, well, you know we all love you dearly and I have no doubt that you will love, cherish and respect Naomi always. We could not wish for a better husband for her or a better brother-in-law for Chloe or a better son-in-law for Rod and I and I welcome you to the family. Please raise your glasses to Naomi and Jack. Now money is funny, it can make people odd. You forget to be happy and you live for your job. And fashion is a passion, a set with a flaw. You can dress to excess, but you'll always want more. And a muscle-toned body may sound like a dream, but no body is better than chocolate ice cream. <laughs> what I'm trying to say is that happiness grows, not through your wages or body or clothes, but in laughter and love and in sharing your life in the arms of another as husband and wife.